Unit 3, Science and Technology, Lesson A, Page 18, Exercise 2, The Effects of Technology, Part A. Listen to a show about driverless car technology. Choose the areas in which the impact of the technology would be mostly positive according to the speakers. Hello, and welcome to Eyes on Tech, a show that brings you the cutting edge of today's technology. I'm your host, Tim Arnold. Today, I'm taking a ride with our technology editor, Crystal Morton, in a car with no driver. That's right, Tim. It's a little frightening, isn't it? I have to admit it is a little. Well, don't worry, Tim. Everyone's nervous at first. You'll get used to it. But driverless car technology is safe, isn't it? Well, it's actually still in development, so I'm not sure anyone can say it's perfectly safe, because there might be problems the developers haven't encountered yet. But the cars are equipped with lots of laser scanners, radar, and cameras for safe navigation. Some experts even say that if the whole country switched to driverless cars, the number of traffic accidents would fall dramatically. Wow, that would be great. Wouldn't it, though? And another benefit would be the amount of money saved on road construction, as it would no longer be necessary to make roads human-proof with lights, guardrails, safety signs, and the like. That would be a plus. It sounds like everyone would benefit from driverless cars. Well... Not everyone. Businesses that profit from auto accidents, for instance, would lose hundreds of billions of dollars. Gas stations would also feel a negative impact with a drop in sales. Driverless cars usually choose more efficient routes than humans, and they get good gas mileage because of the way they're designed. I can see how that wouldn't be advantageous for the gas companies, but it would certainly be a benefit for consumers. Now, what about professional drivers? If driverless car technology really caught on, there'd be no more need for taxi drivers, truck drivers, bus drivers. There's no question that a lot of changes would occur in the economy. The worldwide changes that could happen are difficult to imagine but they'll likely take place slowly and steadily over time, so the impact won't be such a shock. It's really incredible. Um, how about parking, though? Sometimes parking spaces are nearly impossible to find, especially in the city. Would there be special garages reserved for driverless cars somewhere? No, and there wouldn't have to be. Planners envisioned that driverless cars would often be shared by multiple users. As soon as one dropped you off at your destination, it would then go and pick up another person. This would result in fewer cars on the road, less traffic congestion, and plenty of parking spots. Wow, never having to worry about parking would be great. But I imagine repairs could be quite a headache. I would think that not many people are qualified to repair such complex technology. That's very true. Repairs on the navigation systems require skills that the average auto repairman just doesn't have at this point. Well, I see we're just about out of time. This has certainly been a smooth ride, hasn't it, Crystal? It certainly has. It makes me want to thank the driver. But of course, there isn't one. <laughs> Thanks for riding with us. If you'd like to learn more about driverless car technology, visit...